welcome back to my channel victoria here if it's your first time stopping by welcome today's video is going to be a nighttime routine and not my nighttime routine but i'm going to be following jackie aina's nighttime routine jackie has like such beautiful um clear skin very very glowy and we have the same skin type so she's oily combination which is the same thing that i have so i was like why don't i just follow her skincare routine and you know hopefully what she's using and what works for her would work for me so if you're interested in seeing the results and seeing how this whole thing turns out stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe and hit that thumbs up button for more videos so i was watching her video that she did for Happers and it's called Jackie Aina's nighttime skincare routine. So I just watched the video and I basically Went to Sephora and I picked out almost everything that she had in the video So I'm just going to be watching the video and just following along and I'll be showing you guys what I'm doing All right, so first things first. Um, she's taking off her makeup as you can see. I don't have any makeup on my skin right now. Um So yeah, obviously I have to skip that step, but I do have what she's using. I believe she's using the Clinique take off Take of take the day of cleansing oil. I have this. Um, yeah, I'm just going to fast forward it to the part where she's actually, you know, doing the skincare routine. Because, like I said, I have no makeup on. So I love this one from Dermalogica. They're like it's a nice lather, and it's gentle on the skin. It doesn't make me break out. All right, guys. So the first thing that she used is the Dermalogica Special Cleansing Gel, which looks like this. And I'm gonna do the same. How do you guys apply your skincare? Do you like to like rub it in your hand first and then apply? Or like put it straight on your face and rub it in? What do you do? Let me know, let me know. And again, really make sure you get around that hairline and your nose, your eyes, and then so I'm just going to rinse this off now, okay? Okay, guys, so I have rinsed off the cleanser, and the next thing that she does is she uses um micellar water from simple to I guess take off any leftover makeup I have micellar water from Garnier dedicate skin and eyes okay so I'll just use this I have no makeup on like I said but yeah just to follow anti jacket routine you know yeah as you can see my skin is pretty clean so she's moving on to exfoliating one that I really like is another one from Dermalogica, the Daily Microfoliant. So she has Dermalogica Daily Microfoliant. So far so good, like everything feels nice, nothing is, you know, making my skin tingle. It feels really really good, like my skin doesn't feel... You know when you know when you use a cleanser that completely strips off all the oil on your skin and you just feel tight and dry? My skin doesn't feel like that, so it's nice. So I like to focus on my cheeks whenever I'm using any kind of exfoliant because that's where I have like most of my breakouts. Okay, so now I'm just using a paper towel to just dry my face. Always pat guys, don't rub. My skin feels really really nice after the scrub. Alright you guys, so next she used a toner and the toner she used was the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner from Fresh. Looks like that. It has the uh, rose petals in it. Kind of cool. Okay, sure. I'm going to take my SK2 Essence. It's a little on the pricey side, but it's not too But I really like it and it's very gentle. This you can apply with your hands, you just press it. Alright, so the next thing she mentioned is the SK2 Facial Treatment Essence. That looks like this. So, I'm just going to do what she's doing and apply it with my hands. And press it into the skin. This essence smells very strange. I don't like the smell at all. Okay, so obviously I don't have the esthetician serum and it's not sold at Sephora. So I have this one from Dema E, Vitamin C Concentrated Serum with Hyaluronic Acid in it. I'm going to just substitute that. Stop skipping oil. Don't be afraid of oil. And definitely don't be afraid of 
be afraid of serums. Alright, so I just realized I forgot to get the eye cream, but I did pick up the Biosense Squalane, Squalane Plus Marine Algae Eye Cream, which looks like this. So I will use this. And the last product that she uses is the Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. I've tried this a couple times and I really, really like this. It's interesting that she uses this because it says that it's for normal to dry skin. But she uses it, so... I guess. But I like it though because I find that um, during winter, my skin, even though it's oily combination, I get like really really dry. I'm just going to apply a bit of this moisturizer to my skin. Oh Alright guys. I feel so good. Yeah, I'll show you guys what my skin is looking like. It actually feels great. Like all of the products feel really, really nice on my skin and I'm not having any kind of weird reaction so far like I feel I feel good so thumbs up for that anyway.